Hey guys, welcome back to BJ Tech News, and this is Bernardo. So this is another quick tip for you guys, another quick server 2012 tip. Now, remember when you first installed that server operating system on your physical machine or virtual machine, and you need to push out patches, and most likely when you're pushing out patches, you're going into your Internet Explorer, right? So, and you get that little pesty little i.e. enhanced security dialog box that basically wants you to add it into the trusted list and you're constantly getting it over and over and over and over and over again now what I mean is this so you go into your browser let's go you want to go into google.com to you know search some patches that you need on your server and you get this annoying Internet Explorer security enhancement thing that they started doing I believe in um, in 2008 they started doing it actually they always had it before and uh, 2008 R2, 2008 regular, and server 2012, they made it a little easier for us to go in there and disable it. Now, in server 2012, the way that you disable this little pesty little thing, you gotta see, it's, it's so annoying. You gotta click close, 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 then you gotta add it, then you gotta add this, and you gotta add that. It's just so weird. So, the way that you do it is I'm gonna close this. You wanna open up your, your server manager, which I, that's, I just closed just now, and you wanna go to your local server. And believe it or not, this is right here inside the property section of your uh, server. There's an IE enhanced security configuration. By default, it's always turned on. So what you want to do is configure it. You want to turn that stuff off. Now, best practices is your server shouldn't be going outside at all. It shouldn't be browsing anything. But most likely, a lot of IT people... Once they install the operating system, they go online to get like certain little tools or plugins or utilities to help them a little bit more in their server. Uh, but that's really up to you. If you do ins do this, I would say install whatever you need, um, get it done, get all the patches that you need on your server, and once you're done, go back into your IE enhanced security configuration section and turn that stuff back on. And that's it, guys. That's how you disable it that way. Uh, so if right now, if I press OK and I close this up and let me get into my IE and let's say I want to go search for google.com and as you can see the dialog box did not pop up for me because I disabled it now I'm able to go in get whatever I need for this server once I get it you know best practice go back enable those options again for security reasons and that's it guys hopefully you guys enjoyed this quick tip and I catch you guys later peace out